When River was born, he was three pounds, 10 ounces. I got pictures of him. I was holding him. His head was in my hand, like that. Just his face, little bitty. You can't explain how one minute you're one way and the next minute you're another way. You didn't know that you could love something so much. We got pregnant in the spring of 2019 and we had a difficult pregnancy. I had preeclampsia and gestational diabetes. I was about 34 weeks and two days when I went in to the hospital. They had scheduled to do the C-section at 4 a.m. and at 2 a.m. his um, heart started to decel. And so the NICU team was right there to get him and they uh, started working on him and he just needed a little bit of help because his lungs were ready. The nurses at the Christus NICU were amazing. I mean, just so kind and helpful. And then we started realizing that he has an issue, one of his eyes and then one side of his body. He's leaning to the weak side, falling over, and I'm feeding him and he's just falling over and I set him back up, you know, and, and he's not holding his bottle because, well, he's little, he's a preemie. And now that I know what I know, I can see it. But at the time, you know, I'm a new mom. Dr. Osteen referred him to neurology. Neurology found that he had cerebral palsy. It's the damage of the midline of the brain. Cerebral palsy, or often called CP, is a neurological disorder that occurs in some children when their brain does not develop normally in the womb or when they have damage that occurs when they are in the womb or at birth or shortly after birth. We don't know when, we just know it happened. And it really only affects um, his motor skills. Cerebral palsy is usually treated by therapies and sometimes with medication or even surgeries. With River, he receives physical therapy and occupational therapy because cerebral palsy causes difficulty with using his muscles and with therapy we're able to help him gain use of the right side of his body which is the side that's affected in his case. It has been amazing to watch him progress. From there to now is night and day. He gets excited about learning new things. Yeah. River is a joy to work with. He is very motivated to move. He is very fun. He's very uh, intelligent. He a D E game F I B E five. Let's do number nine. Some people think that all kids that have cerebral palsy have an intellectual impairment, and that is not true. He's very smart, and that makes it so much easier to work toward goals and to really push him to the next steps. I have the mindset of, well, we're going to roll with it. We'll adapt to we'll do whatever. I'm going to have to buy a left-handed fishing pole, but we'll be fine. We just have nothing but the highest hope for him. Every day, he just progresses and progresses and progresses. I feel blessed to have him. <laughs> so he is my miracle. He is cute, too, though. So. <laughs>